Hello everyone, welcome to episode 2 of reviewing and unboxing a deck of cards I won in this prize brick giveaway, you could call it, from Sean Devine. If you haven't had a chance to see the actual unboxing and what decks I actually received, I'm going to leave that video in the description. I'm also going to leave the deck review of the very first deck I showed in the description, along with a link to Sean's channel so you can go and subscribe to him. Now, I already have taken the two decks of cards out of the box for review, and I'm going in the order of reviewing the decks for how Sean showed them when he did his video, and also how he has them in the box. Now, like I said, I already have the two decks out, and just to save some time, I actually took off the cellophane a little bit, just because I always have trouble doing that, and then that takes three to four minutes. But as you can see, the two decks are going to be the Bicycle GT Speed Readers. So as you can see, it's a normal bicycle uh, front box, but it says Mandolin back. Then it says GT Speed Reader, uh, Standard Edition Custom Marked Deck. Now this is the Red Edition. So this says Air Cushion Finish, Made in the USA. This says uh, the United States Playing Card Company. And then you can see the back is going to be different than your normal bicycle decks, okay? So as you can see, the bicycle decks has the angels on like the, I'm going to call it a bicycle, hence the name. And then right here, they're sort of like floating. And then the blue uh, box is the same thing. And you can see I actually took some of the tuck wrap off just to make it easier to get into. So let's go ahead and unbox this uh, tuck case a little more now and see what we have here. Okay, so right off the bat, what we actually have is a sort of like a sticker that says GT Speed Reader. So I'm going to actually leave this bottom uh, tuck wrap on just because I heard it can protect your boxes, okay? And we're going to actually crack these open and get right into them. So bring that down a little bit, and let's see how these are marked. So if you don't have these cards and you don't want to see the marking system, I wouldn't watch this video any further. But if you don't really care, then... It's up to you, obviously, if you want to watch. Okay, so, opening up the box, it's going to be just like Bicycle. Ah, okay, so, you do receive a couple of uh, things here. So, the first thing you're going to receive is a... Official Poker Hand Rankings, Rankings from Lowest to Highest, and they have the different types of hands there. Maybe a little hard to see. I'm going to do it as close as I can. And then the other side. And then on the back here, it's going to have a instruction card info, coupon is not valid. However, it's going to show you how to read the marked deck here. And then it has the two coupons, obviously. Okay, so this is a very nice card because it gives you a poker hand and then you can also read the cards as well. So, along with this deck, you, you are going to receive a double backer, okay? So that means eventually, maybe my next video, or maybe I will wait until the very end 
I can make an updated video on on some playing cards you can buy that come with double backers. If you haven't seen my last video on that, I will link it in the description. And then you are going to come with <clears throat> two jokers, and they happen to be identical, meaning I can make a video on identical jokers and duplicate cards, because this is sort of duplicate cards. So expect those three videos in the future someday. Before we actually get into the markings themselves, I just want to go ahead now and show off what this deck looks like. So you're going to get your Ace of Spades, obviously, and it's going to be a normal, okay, just like that. So nothing to actually worry about there. And then you have your two, your three, your four, and all these number cards are going to be the same up to ten. As you can see right here. Now a great thing about this also is that the court cards are going to be the same. So Jack, Queen, and King. And really, all the other cards are going to be Bicycle. So there's your Ace, your Two, your Three, and I will go right down to King for you, just so you know that they are the same. And then, we will get into how to read the markings, and then we will actually try to read a few of the cards as well. I may save that until the end, though after I do the blue bicycle deck. So we have king, queen, jack. And so yeah, this is a normal bicycle deck, which is really great, okay? But the only thing is, it's marked, <clears throat> but does come with two duplicate jokers, or identical, which is always great. That's one of my, that's like a thing I love identical jokers, and then it comes with a double backer, and I do have some videos on double backers, so I may have to upload a marked deck effect, one or two, and then a double backer effect again, but I will get that all sorted out and then let you know what I'm thinking. So yeah, you can see all the cards are going to be a uh, normal. <clears throat> Let's get into the blue deck now, and then we will go ahead and look at the markings here. So put these away, and we will get into the blue deck. So I always open up new decks of cards with any random card. Because if you put it right into that little hole, and then you just go back and forth as carefully as you can while moving down, you're going to be able to actually get the a box to open. So there we go. And then we will move over carefully. Break that seal. And then I put the card right in, and then I go back and forth a couple of times. And then I can open it, just like brand new. So if we take out these cards, now the blue ones, you are going to receive the same card as before, a double backer, two identical jokers, and then all of the cards are going to be the same just like this okay so nothing is going to be different but i will run through them really quick just so you can see i'm really excited to play around with these marked cards because i do have a marked deck however the united states playing card company actually messed up the markings those aren't my words those are the words from the person who created the deck. I'm not going to say the deck out loud, but I do want to let you know that. 
So let's actually keep this deck out. Get we can keep the marked card just for the heck of it. And then we will go with the red deck and keep the marked card, but get rid of the rest. Okay, so in order to read the markings, it's going to say how to read the GT reverse marked deck. Look at the markings on the lower left and upper right corners on the sample card to the right, the three of hearts. So if we go ahead and we take out uh, this card here, okay, so I just want to see something. Oh, okay, perfect. So if we look right here, you're going to see right Try to do this as close as I can. Get my hand to stop moving. Right there, you're going to see the A, and then you're going to see the heart. That is on the lower left corner. Oh, geez. And that is going to tell you that the card is the three of hearts. Let me uh, get these back in order, and then I can show you that again. Okay, so we have there and there. Okay, so right here, you're going to see A and heart. That is on the lower left corner. That is going to be your three of hearts. Now, if you flip the card over, so for the right side, okay, it's going to have A and heart for the ace of hearts. And then if you flip it again, a and heart for ace of hearts and this actually goes for all of the cards so if we try uh this card you're gonna see two and heart two of hearts and then it's gonna be the two of hearts and this is really how all of them are marked now, if we go to a court card here, so let's say we go to the jack, it's going to have your, this side, J and heart, the jack of hearts, okay? So that is how you're going to read the markings on the GT Speed Readers. Probably the easiest marking system I have ever come across and I don't think anyone should really uh, notice this. But yeah, that's a really great marking system. Let's go ahead now and try to read a few of these markings. And then that will be the video. So if I put down uh, this card here. Okay, so what card, if you can tell, do you think this is? Okay, so... I'm going to try to hold it good. Okay. This is the two of clubs, as you can see there. I will do one more, and then I will leave it face down. I'll show you what I mean. If we do this one, okay, which card do you think this is? Maybe hard to see. But this is the Six of Clubs. And then I will do two cards like uh, this. So this card, just by looking at it, is the Queen of Diamonds, which I can tell. And then if I do one more card, this is the Six of Diamonds, just like that. And this is the GT Speed Reader. So, as you can tell, it's a very nice deck. The markings are, like, so easy to read. 
And I will give you a couple of cards from the blue deck, just so you know that they are the same. So if we go with uh, this card, which one do you think this is? This is the Three of Clubs, okay, as you can see there. If we grab this card here, which one is this? This is the Six of Clubs. And then I will do two cards like this. So just by looking, this is the Jack of Diamonds. And there's like no ice drain. If you know where to look, you can pick it up like perfect. It's in the lower left corner. It doesn't matter which hand you hold it in because it's still in the left corner. And then if you turn the card around or if you go diagonally right up from that lower left corner, it will be in this upper right corner right here. So here's the marking and here's the marking. And they're both on the lower left corner, which is great. So this is the Eight of Clubs. And there you go. And I think that is going to be the video for today. So I hope you really enjoyed this video. I was really excited to unbox these decks and check out the markings. And I have to say, I am not disappointed by any means. So I hope you really enjoyed this video. I will be making my next video I want to make will be on one effect or like a double deck effect using a marked deck. And then eventually, I'm not too sure when, I'm thinking at the end of the deck reviews, I will do updated videos on double backers, uh, identical jokers, and sort of like identical cards in a way but yeah that's the video if you are new here don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i will see you next time with another a, a video bye